for anybody who's ever super tired when you get home, just like I am right now, you're ready to go to bed, uh, you know, maybe you just want to relax, but you're still super hungry. If you're gone or if you haven't eaten much and you're just tired, you get home and you're just, you know, want to maybe order some food or make a pizza. Um, uh, I just wanted to make a video that I think is a way better alternative. There are a couple reasons why. One, it is way healthier for you than pretty much anything you could ever order that is, you know, at a restaurant. Number two, it is way, um, I said healthier, right? So it's cheaper. And number three, it's faster than anything, like even probably a drive through I would say. And to prove it to you, I'm going to make it right now, in real time, okay? And what I'm going to make is a freaking sweet potato. It's so easy, I'm going to demonstrate it as such, okay? Here we go. You take the freaking sweet potato, which you have already bought because you're an adult, and adults buy groceries and freaking have them. And sweet potatoes are awesome because you can keep them for a long time. You don't have to like eat them all in one week. So buy sweet potatoes and eat them. Look, you just wash it. So easy. If you have a veggie wash, use it. washed the sweet potato. Next step is to put oil into the pan that you want to use. You can use uh, any kind of oil except for canola or like vegetable, you know, those hydrogenated oils. Use something good. Just get coconut oil, uh, you can use butter, you can use olive oil, but like the, the cooking kind, not the salad kind. Um, and uh, ghee, I guess, is another one. Just something healthy because it's so easy. Okay. Um, so you have the sweet potato, and I'm going to use coconut oil today. No, no, I'm going to use olive oil today, because I want to make my sweet potatoes with garlic. Um, but, yay, some oil. You can definitely be generous with the oil here, because it's going to be pretty much like a healthier version of fries, and it's awesome. Okay, then you take the freaking sweet potato and you cut it up. It's so easy. Okay, grab a knife. And there are a couple different ways that you can cut up your freaking sweet potato. First of all, usually you want to cut off the ends. Done. Okay. Then you can do one of two things. You can cut it like this with a smaller knife if you want. It's probably faster and quieter or whatever. I'm just going to cut it on a cutting board because um, that's what I want to do. So then you freaking cut it on a cutting board so quick, okay? Let's just do this. Okay, done, <gasps> all right, and then we freaking toss the sweet potatoes into the freaking pan, all right? So here we go, yay, done. Then, the next part, you turn on the pan. I'm going to use, if it's on a scale of like, 1 to 10 heat, I would say use like 6 to 8 because honestly sweet potatoes can take a long time to cook. Um, if you want to let them simmer and cook slowly and go do something for like 15 minutes, you actually can. Another great way to just eat fast and healthy. Just like this is the best thing and 
Another awesome thing I like about sweet potatoes is you can add any spices and have different kind of meals and it takes like it's one ingredient. Once you have the sweet potatoes in the pan, as such, you just like spread the oil all over and then add literally just whatever spices you want. So I'm gonna do some salt. White pepper, and I really like garlic, and I'm gonna add some cumin, cumin, however the frick you say it. I'm gonna add that, and I think that's all I want for my spices today. So, I mean, you don't have to add garlic. We just happen to have some chopped up garlic. But, you add it, ah. however much you want, because it's your freaking food. I like a lot of garlic. Garlic is the best. Even though it makes you bad breath, I guess, but... It still tastes so good, so it's worth it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and uh, then garlic and, let's see, cumin. So easy. Do, 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 do. Awesome. And then you just add as much as you want. You can do a lot, you can do a little. Oh my god, it already smells awesome! Yay! And then, the best part, you just mix all that stuff up. Almost like tossing a salad. Honestly, also more fun than ordering food, I would say. Okay. That was the hard part. Then, so you cover the pan, and you let it cook. And guess what? In, in what, uh, five minutes maybe? You will have your food. It's so much better, so much healthier, and I'm gonna do a jump cut once it's ready because it's so freaking easy. Then you can just come back and stir it. Okay, so honestly, I actually burned the food. <laughs> it's uh, a little bit crispy, but um, that's not the point. I think the point is already, already made. It is so easy to just make a sweet potato for dinner instead of ordering out or you know spending your hard-earned money it's better for you it's faster you can you know like everything that I did that probably took me five minutes and would have taken less if I didn't have to stop to explain everything and then once you set it you just I like to put it on like a five or six level like medium flame and then let it sit come back and stir it occasionally let it take its time so that it just gets soft and kind of like semi-mushy. You might like yours crispier, like cook it however you want. Add whatever spices you want. And I really, really hope it helps somebody. Thanks for watching.